So where do we... I think we go this way, yeah? Yes. Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay, so switched up some skills, now we have Haunt. That makes a bit more sense, I think. Like it's more spammable and whatnot, and we send two spirits at once, which is kinda cool. It would also enhance our like single target DPS, uh, so that might be helpful if we ever need it, right? Let's try to find the enemies. There we go. Oh, I think we just killed everything. Well, too bad. Too bad. We need to find the courtyard. That can't be too hard, right? That should be an easy job for us, right? So let's go. Kill all the things, though. Oh, we got new lore. About what? The bestial hellions are demons that can be summoned from the burning hells with the aid of foul sorcery. They are given to chasing down their foes and attacking them with savage fangs. This usually allows some spare time for their masters to craft their dark spell work and finish off the victim. Oh, so like summoners? Okay. Well, not hell hellions are like the summons, like an imp would be, I guess. I just don't remember killing a nymph or anything like that, any sort of demonic creature, but I guess I'm just, I guess I'm just stupid. Oh, my memory is bad. That's okay though, because we have a swarm of creatures that kills everything. So that should be a-okay, right? Okay, there is a entrance, I guess. Yep, yep. So we need to explore this area first, because that's what we do. I wish though I didn't have to run around and collect loot after my minions kill them, right? It uh, involves a lot of backtracking. Maybe there would be like something I can do later on. These enemies defy all that will help reason. with that, but like right now, it is a bit annoying. A bit annoying to run around and collect loot after my gargantuans and dogs and spiders just annihilate the whole map. I like those slime blobs, so it's pretty cool. Oh, I think I should not... I thought I could circle... Okay, I guess I can. Like, I thought I would circle around like this, right? And yeah, we can, okay. I'm glad I'm, I'm glad we can, because otherwise we would need to run all the way back. No drums for you, I'm afraid. I'm afraid drums aren't appreciated here. Okay, well this was like not relevant. Looks at Leah. Maybe he's in love. You think a man like that can fall in love? Oh, so we're gonna be talking about other characters too, about other followers, companions. That's kind of neat. Some gossiping going on. Pretty decent. So is he... I mean... Are we okay with him being in love with uh, Leah? I don't see what the problem is. The haunted manor. Of course they'd be drawn here. Did they just multiply? Oh, the, those were probably illusions. That would make more sense. That would make more sense than uh, the cultists just cloning themselves. A dead adventure. So many dead corpses just lying around everywhere. Sadly, they contain no loot. But... What can you do? Oh, there we go. A glowing chest. Give us something good. I mean, that was a blue item. An uncommon item, as we've learned. Oh, seems like we are done here. So let's go to the manor. Wasting our frenzied buff, but that's okay. That's alright. Oh, we got some new lore again. I strike at your heart. 
I do not have enough mana. Oh, we ran out of mana. How sad is that? Okay, so what is the a dark berserkers are considered weaker demons, but their strength is still far greater than that of any human. I have found dark spells within the cathedral, written in Archbishop Lazarus's own hand, explaining how to summon them. I pray that no other copies exist, so that this terrible knowledge will be lost forever. Damn. There is a new piece to the game. A girl named Leah. My spies tell me she is the child of the witch Adria, who is hiding in the deserts of Chaldeum. Bring this news to the master at once. Okay, so they are really interested in Leah. That's Leoric, by the way, right? Yeah, so we are definitely, definitely in Leoric's manner, as we can see. As we can see. Also, we just unlocked. A new rune. Some new runes. Summon a spectre. Okay. Okay, this might be interesting. I'm gonna try this one instead of haunt. Where is it? Spirit Barrage? Phantasm? There we go. That can be pretty damn cool. Big Bad Voodoo. Uh, we don't really need that right now i don't think i don't think so and local swarm enemies affected deal reduced damage well that's not relevant too much that's not so how does this work oh this is cool as hell and how long do they last five seconds damn this is this is amazing okay Oh, I'm liking. I'm liking this so far. Uh, they do damage as cold, sadly. Sadly, no poison, but we can deal with that. Not too big of a deal. She's unstoppable. No mortal could slaughter our brethren with such ease. She is here. You caught Tizara's sickness. I will purge you. Delay her while I prepare her demise in the depths below. Well, this was cool. This was really cool. Like, these fa phantasms are actually... Awesome. They did horrible things to us. I seek another man, a prisoner in rags. Yes, the man with the golden eyes. I saw Magda take him into Leoric's old torture chambers below us. Rest now. I will punish Magda and her cultists. Okay, let's find our angel friend. Let's... let's go. So how deep... How deep is his manner? Oh, this is a lot of burning stuff. I feel like I know where this is going to... Like, uh... I feel like I know which boss we would fight here. But we will see. But we will see. Wow, it's just like... No enemies whatsoever. Seems kind of boring. Like, I'm used to just slaughtering people on every single step we make. And now there's a little bit of downtime. Oh, there's like a musty lectern. We need to read that. Is it musty? Musty? I, s I, I don't know. I don't know. I am convinced that some malevolent being is attempting to wrest control of my thoughts away from me. Voices direct me to horrendous acts, and there are times when I seem unable to control my body. Lazarus knows. This is certain. He looks at me strangely when he thinks me otherwise disposed. 
I mean, that's Diablo, right? Diablo is trying to control him. Dark Vessel. Okay, what is going on here? I like people getting possessed. People are getting possessed or something like that. They're just standing, doing. Not oh, that man just got. Oh, I think they like uh, modified, like he went into the Iron Maiden and then he popped out as a demon, I think. Okay, we're gonna go back to that in a second. Let's go this way first. Yeah, I definitely feel like I know where this is going. Though my counsel begs me to reconsider, I will continue with the executions of those I find guilty of plotting against the kingdom. Perhaps they fear my eye will fall on them and discover their heinous, treasonous plans as well. Lazarus is the only one I can still trust. Oh, so he went super paranoid and like, uh, just... Lazarus used it Bring for his me, gain or whatever, yeah. You are dead. I don't know, man. All of them, like, are taunting me all the time, but... I have finally rid myself of the dark influence seeking to subdue me. And now I see things as they truly are. This conspiracy among the insolent townsfolk to weaken me by stealing Albrecht away will not stand. Perhaps the heads of their women and children on pikes will bring them clarity. Okay, and he went completely crazy. And that's when uh, the Chancellor decided to kill him or whatever, right? Okay. I mean, pretty, pretty standard. I heard tales about the fall of King Leoric when I was young. But seeing it with my own eyes, it is another thing entirely. Oh, so like this is what Leoric was doing? Like, oh my, that's kind of sad. Uh, like, is this con is this dungeon connected to? That's a goblin. Is this dungeon connected to the madness of King Leoric, or is it just like random, more or less? Like, was he trying to make some torture devices here, or something like that? Oh, what was... Illusionist, okay, yeah. So they, they definitely, like, I make illusions of them, themselves. But they are very easy to kill, right? They all I died, like, instantly. The moment they cloned. Oh, we are... We are full. Oh, we killed one of those things earlier in the game. Like, it was, like, an, a boss at the time. Now it's just a random, a random monster. Just a random monster. Yeah, we need to go back to town and sell some stuff. We definitely do. We definitely do need to go back. Uh, there we go. Salvage. Maybe we need... Okay, let's, uh, let's just check everything. Physical skills do more damage. Regenerates life per second. You know what? This might really help our Templar friend. Like, more damage choice. for physical skills. And this one does intelligence. So yeah, this one was irrelevant for him almost. But I think that's it. Like, we have all these legendary items. And the rare items. Oh, maybe this one is good. Poison resistance. But it has no intelligence on it. But it does give us a lot of crit. I don't think it's relevant, so... Oh, this one is good, but we are wearing a legendary. We can't just, like, trade it off like that. Right? We should be wearing legendaries. 
Well, it takes a while to break everything down, but that's okay. Uh, that's okay, let's continue the journey in the Halls of Agony. Yeah, so this is definitely like his torture chamber thing. Dungeon. And it's a lot of people, by the way. Like, if all of those corpses are people that Leoric tortured to figure out whether they wanted to betray him, that's a lot of people. That's definitely a lot of people. Empty. Are they summoning? I think they are summoning and we are killing them way too fast to see what they are actually summoning. That's kind of lame. Need more mana. Gonna, gonna go in a straight line first. We're gonna see whether there is something, something this way. Then we're gonna try to branch out, circle. Oh, that's the right way. God damn! What was that? Was that a goblin? Another treasure goblin? Look at that! All the treasure goblins, all the dead treasure goblins. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how portals work. I feel like I should, like, for once, let them stay alive and see what happens. Also, I would assume that that uh, burning furnace does a lot more damage than it actually does. We're, we just walk through it and nothing really happens. Oh yeah, they are definitely summoning, look at that. My curse upon you! And they are summoning demons, so Leah was wrong or whatever, right? There are demons. Not only just corpses and whatnot. <laughs> we are just walking through that fire like no big deal. Kinda funny. Kinda funny. Oh, okay. Okay, so let's go this way then. Whatever was being summoned from there, we absolutely annihilated it with all of our spirits and spiders. It's kinda... I don't know. I don't know, the game is kind of easy. Like, the, ch the challenge right now is more about executing, like, using proper skills to maximize the DPS uh, and not necessarily like beating the encounters, right? Because, I mean, it's almost a guarantee that we are going to win the fight. It's just that how I fast are we going bodies. to win the fight. You think my summoners can just conjure up a demon whenever it pleases them? We must have blood. Fresh blood, mind you. And human flesh to bolster our magic. I will be expecting a reply from you shortly. Uh, so bravery has not wavered once. I salute you, milady. There is no reason to fear death. I agree. So who was that letter addressed to? Maybe like the chancellor, uh, not the chancellor, but um, the advisor of King Leoric, La Lasan, not Lassander, but something like that. I'm bad at names. I'm really bad at names. Uh. Probably to that guy, the one that um, made Leoric mad or whatever, or like uh, made him fall deeper into his madness, right? This is like, is this like a sacrificial pit or something? That 
There was barely any gold there. Like this Templar, he is really hyped about like 20 gold dropping. Oh, we are so fast. We so fast. Let's run. Yeah, I guess we are done here. Oh, people are climbing out of this fire pit. That's cute. Go spirits. Oh, there is still some stuff going on. Oh, too far. Too far. Go spiders. There we go. Oh, that's 400 gold. We need to go back. Now we need to go back. 400 gold. That's a lot, right? Damn. Okay, so to the highlands we go. Why is it turn that way? Are they waiting for something? Like is there going to be... I don't know. I mean Kazura are like uh, with um, Belial, right? So are those corpses. Or like the demons or whatever they are. Well, I don't really... Yeah, so these are dark berserkers. So these berserkers are demons summoned by those cultists. So... I, I don't know. I guess it was just random positioning. I shouldn't read too much into that. But it felt like they were like bracing for an impact or something. So like, I thought that maybe there will be like a giant ballista shot or something flying into us. But it did not, did not happen. The Cursed Hold. Wait, it's a queen? It's Leoric's wife? I am a Scylla, once queen to our beloved Leoric. My servants and I were consumed by his madness. Now I give you my blessing, champion, to release my people from their eternal torment. The imprisoned angel. Was she beheaded? I mean... In my time, I have often argued with the spirits. I did not always believe they knew the true path for me. I do not understand. No, you do not. When the spirits and I look at you, we agree. We say this is a good man. There is no darkness in him. There never was. Confront what you call your sins, and I say you will find nothing there. Test your faith and prove me wrong. I cannot lie. That has occurred to me. If it were true, it would ruin everything I fight for. Everything. Starved of the sun, I no longer know what day it is. I can hear the warden, my husband, and that dog Lazarus discussing my fate. My life will be over soon, yet I fear more for my poor Albrecht's future in the wake of his father's madness. If only Aiden were here. Lazarus, not Lathander. There we go. Uh, also, your poor son probably became Diablo, as far as we know. Okay, so this is branching out. We need to rem to free prisoners. Wait, un aren't they dead? I feel like all of this happened a while ago, didn't it? I but like everyone kind of behaves like it was just yesterday or whatever. So I don't know. A perfect strike. There, a worthy foe. This is awesome, like the fact that we can actually um, toss abilities through this uh, bars. That's pretty damn cool to me. That seems amazing. Although I'm getting kind of lost right now and like we are scoring kills all over the place so looting this is gonna be a nightmare.
it already is. So let's go this this way and then circle around that way. Like this, there we go. This should do it. Now we killed a lot of things here, but they didn't seem to drop anything. Well, too bad. Too bad. Let's go. Horror! I mean, that's more of an abomination, but you can call it horror if you want. Sure. Nothing is being dropped, like not even gold. That is so, so weird. Like you would think at least some gold would be dropped, but no. I mean, I assume we are getting experience and whatnot, right? I mean, obviously we are getting experience, but... There we go, at least some loot. Glorious. A glorious. Well fought. We haven't seen any prisoners that we can free. That is not good. Also even here? Or do we need to go like deeper into the... Into the cursed hole? Can we... Oh, we can't go there? Okay, so I assume this will open or something. Oh, there we go, a yellow marker on the map. Oh, so freeing prisoners is freeing their souls by... Burning their bodies, or like... Uh... What is the opposite of desecrating? Consecrating their body, like... I think it's consecrating? I grow in power. Basically we are purifying... I, I don't I don't know what we are doing, but we are... Leading... Le helping the spirits rest. There we go. Oh, we unlocked an, a, a new room for for Gargantian, also Warden. Okay, so there is a Warden here. Obviously, why wouldn't there be a Warden here? Uh, yeah. Slow burn. Create pools of frost. I don't care about frost, I want poison. Although, that's pretty damn cool. Oh, those are pretty damn cool. Gargantian, though. Restful Protector. A more powerful Gargantian to fight for you for 15 seconds. Oh, so it's more of a... You summon it when you actually need it. And it's a little bit more potent, but obviously it has a cooldown and, like, a, a duration. Which I'm not too happy about. It's fine though. There was a goblin! I heard a goblin. Let's just hope that he doesn't run away. There, there he is. Oh no, he is like inside there. Oh, oh, oh no, he is not. For some reason I tunnel visioned on the map and didn't actually look at the goblin himself. Those spirits don't do nowhere near enough damage I would hope they would do. So maybe we should replace them. I am free. You are. My gosh, there is someone amongst us. Deal with her harshly. So they actually like... They actually trapped. Damn. 
They actually trap those spirits. It, it's not like reason. they are there because they are cursed or whatever. They are actually trapped I by a warden anymore. for whatever reason. Freedom. At long last. Freedom. Yeah, let's go back quickly. Destroy everything we have. Well, maybe not everything, but... Lots of looting going on. Like, I was just a second ago complaining how we are... How nothing is dropping, and now we almost instantly need to go back. I think I'm gonna replace this one. I think this is the way to go. He does need a ring, so... 510 damage. I guess this ah, will help. Good. Probably? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, increases gargantuan damage. Let's equip that. And the fetish armor damage? Nah. We are using gargantuan way more often than the fetish army. Maybe I should use them a lot more often then. But I'm kind of saving them up for when I actually need them. But it's the same as... Mm, like uh, saving up your potions and whatnot in games, right? You like there comes a point where you just have so many of them because you were always trying to save them for like a perfect scenario when or they would be useful, but it will never happen, and so you just have your stashes like filled with hundreds of potions. Okay, Leah, nothing, nothing, nothing from Leah. You know what I'll miss about Oh. Oh, so he, like, he spent here quite, quite some time. He wasn't just stopping by for a day or so. He was actually living here for a long time. I am free! Thank you, champion. My servants are now free, but the curse over this place remains. Seek the warden at the dungeon center and end his evil forever. Will do. Uh, seek the warden at the center. Oh, that's convenient. So we don't actually need to to try and find him now. He's just gonna be sitting in the center waiting for us. And there are like four passages there. I would hope so. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. So warden. Am I alone here? Must I do this myself? <laughs> so be it. Face me. <laughs> Your oh, he looks kind of derpy. He is nowhere near as intimidating. Oh no! As his voice is... Well, I just stood in that explosion like an idiot, but... Yeah, he was nowhere near as intimidating as his voice was. I, I was expecting some like huge monster and it's just a skeleton in stupid looking pants. And he died almost instantly too, which doesn't help his case whatsoever. A perfect strike. What is what is happening there? My lord, the prisoner is ready, as you requested. Thank you, Lazarus. Your loyalty is invaluable in the midst of all these traitors. And you, my dear. My own wife and queen, conspiring against our kingdom. My love, I swear, I have never betrayed you. Lies. Until the very end. A grim end to a noble woman. I am proud to have played my part in Leoric's fall. Wow. Okay. Uh, I'm. She remained calm the until time the very end. Of my lord's true awakening is at hand. That fool Leoric was only able to resist him because he did not yet possess his full power. 
with the Queen dispatched as a traitor, I may now devote myself fully to preparing the boy for the presence of my master. Damn. So yeah, Diablo, all the good stuff. Halls of Agony level 3. So back to this fiery fiery pits of torture and doom. Well, it so seems like uh, the demons aren't being summoned until they actually walk up to this uh, to this place. Portal, I guess. I guess it would be called a portal. Oh, movement speed and pickup range. Let's try to utilize this as much as we can. Just run as fast as we can. Your evil undoes you. I think we just lost our killing spree. No, we didn't. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, now we lost it. Damn. I should have uh, used my acid. Acid rain, acid cloud, a little bit, a little bit earlier there. Okay, did we miss out on some loot? No, somehow, somehow. What is that? Unholy roll? Now that thing looks amazing. Um, well, let's go this way. Why the hell not? No, oh, so we are encountering more and more demons the further we go in. There, a worthy foe. But like as we know, Lazarus used uh, Liora just to basically summon Diablo. So obviously the that's what was burns. happening in these halls and whatnot. Like they were sacrificing people to gather more power. For the ritual, probably. Okay, go my fetish army. All the abominable stalling. In case it was not clear, I need the sacrifices now! I've heard enough of your idle complaints that the villagers have fled from the highlands, leaving no one left to sacrifice. You'll best come up with something, or it's your hide will be flaying. So is that... I'm pretty sure that's also letters to Lazarus. The truth burns. I'm pretty sure that's the case. Oh damn, there was a globe right here. We lost our power buff. Too bad. So yeah, they go into the Iron Maiden and emerge as a demonic entity. Oh, what is that pit? Fearless Veteran. Oh, we are level 40. That's cool. Now that's cool. Burning Dogs. Ooh. Oh, we, we need to go that way. Let's not go that way then. And we got some Burning Dogs and we are level 40. Oh, new passive at level 70. That's very far away. That's very far away. Okay, so we have Burning Dogs now. I don't know, I feel like rabbit dogs are pretty cool. I feel like that's good enough. We got some new runes for the fetish army. Okay then, let's uh, Let's see what's going on here. Decrease the cooldown? Yes, please. Now that's gonna make me... At least hopefully that's gonna make me use it. This skill way more often than I do. 
Oh, we need to go all the way back? God damn it, my bad. But I didn't know. Oh, and I completely wasted my XP buff. But I don't think it matters too much, like... I feel like we are incredibly overleveled. So it doesn't even matter. Like, at this stage in the game, like, for what we are trying to achieve here, like, I'm just playing through campaign. I'm not trying to maximize any XP gains. Like, to get to the end game faster and whatnot, right? I'm, I just want to experience the story. So it doesn't really... matter. The truth burns you. The truth burns you. That's an interesting phrase. Like, why would you say that? Are, like, the spirits never lie or something like that? I don't know. I don't know. Or maybe they are fighting, like... I... Lord of Lies? Something like that? Like, if Diablo is Lord of Terror... Uh, there should be like Lord of Lies and whatnot. I don't know what Belial is. I think he might be Lord of Lies. I mean, Asmodan is Lord of uh, Sin, right? I don't know who Belial is. What his title is. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we found the portal, so that's good, right? But now we need to run all the way back. Also rats, can we kill rats? Nope. Rats are too damn strong. Too damn strong. Uh, grass... Gargantian! More Gargantian damage? Yes! Let's buff that thing up to incredible levels. Because it's, it's pretty good. A Gargantian is probably the most of our damage output, I would think. Or maybe not, maybe our Acid Rain, Acid Cloud. But Acid Cloud consumes mana, right? And it's like... Gargantian is just running around doing its thing. Which is pretty nice. Okay. Leah must be back in Tristram, crying over the old man's corpse. She'll soon have another one to cry over. Yours! Meet the butcher. Yes, the butcher. Yeah, I definitely. I mean, the setting in this whole dungeon was really. It just gave it away, basically, right? The butcher, fresh meat. Let's go. More like dead meat, right? I should just be using. Oh, he just. Oh, okay, so he uses his charge. Like, he projects a giant, like, uh, cry. Oh, that's not... I need mana. Oh, right, so all of his skills are, like, uh... I mean, it doesn't matter at this point. Because we killed him. But you can see all of his skills when he casts them. Like, uh, he... What is the word? I, for some reason, I just... I'm completely blanking out on the word, but he basically, like, he shouts in the direction where he is going to use a skill, and then he points his hook in the direction where he's going to hook people, so that you can dodge them. Oh, did we get some lore that I missed out on? Uh, did we? There we go, Butcher. The truth about the Butcher Demon was more startling than I ever anticipated. Evidently, there are many of them within the Burning Hells though they used to be solely under Diablo's command. The Butchers are stitched together from the parts of other demons to combine their strengths, then given life through wicked magic. Oh, so it's not THE Butcher, it's A Butcher? Why is it THE Butcher then? And, I mean, they are stitched together from the parts of other demons. It's literally the abomination from, uh, like, Warcraft lore. 
plus poison damage and intelligence and attack speed. Damn, this thing is really good. This thing is pretty damn cool. Level requirement reduced by 2. That's not relevant, I don't think. And monster kills grant a ton of XP. I'm gonna equip it probably. I mean, it's a good sword. Like, it has good da damage. It also adds a lot of poison damage. But let's say... Uh, bonus XP 50. So if we equip it on this guy... Yeah, it only will offer 14 of that bonus experience. No way. What do you mean, no way? Oh, there we go. Yeah. It's a lot more potent when we use it. Oh, yeah. There we go, and there we go. This will help. And we probably have a fetish somewhere. No, we don't. I mean, we're gonna craft it, but this sword is way too cool. Way too cool. Uh, but yeah, we killed the butcher. Pretty, pretty damn awesome. Pretty hyped about that. What is this? There is a lot of blood here, by the way. Okay, our angel friend is being tortured. Save him, friends. And by friends, I mean pets. I do not have enough. Money. Oh my god! It exploded like a, a short circuit or something like that. Dying. Take your sword, Angel. My sword. Oh, damn. I remember now. I was an archangel of the high heavens. I was the embodiment of justice. I was. I am. Tyrael. I like how his voice completely changed, like he was just a man, just like a man that was dying or whatever, so he spoke kind of like, I don't know, very, very low, and now he's like, I am the embodiment of justice, the cereal of the archangels of the heavens. That's pretty damn awesome. You have pretty awesome. my mind, friend, and now I remember the warning I came to deliver. Belial and Asmodan, the last lords of hell, are unleashing a tide of darkness that will drown this world. Already, Belial's shadow has fallen upon Chaldeum. Belial and his legions will find justice at my hands. He will not escape punishment. We must move quickly. Let us return to Tristram and make ready. 